name is Kathy, and today I'll be teaching the Scottish song I'll A Kai in by Yon Town from the 52 Scot Scottish Songs for All Harps book by Sylvia Woods. But before I do, I wanted to tell you that I have a great many videos now on many different topics, and so I've decided to make several different video playlists so that it's easier to find the videos of greatest interest. So please check out my playlist page. In I Kai, In By Yon Town, is a traditional Scottish folk song that Robert Burns wrote words to in 1795. It is a bright and happy piece of music. The original tune was called Al Gang Nai Mayer to Yon Town, which translates into I will always call in by that town, and also I will go no more to that town. Confusing to say the least. <laughs> now, I'll teach the easy version first and then the advanced version. Then I'll play the easy version with all of the elements discussed and then the advanced version. When performing this piece of music as a solo in public, it's nice to play the easy version and then immediately play the advanced version for a wonderful full-toned effect. And I will demonstrate this as well. Hello! When learning this piece of music, clap and count out the right hand and the left hand, and then learn it hands separately and put it hands together. I'll a kai in by town town is written in the key of G major, so remember to engage all the F sharping levers before you begin. I'll a kai in by town town also has a DC L fine at the end of the piece, which means that when you played the whole piece through, you go back to the beginning and play until the double bar line with the word fine above it which is the true ending of the piece of music. Now, all music tells a story, and I'm not talking about the words of the song. Rather, I'm speaking about the music itself. In I'll A Kai In By Ton Town, the melody is in the right hand, and the accompaniment is in the left hand. So make sure that the right hand melody is louder overall than the left hand. In all music, there's a beginning, an ending, and a climax point, and we will discuss each of these elements now. In music, it is a general rule of thumb that when the notes of the melody, in this case the right hand notes, uh, rise in pitch, lower notes to higher notes, that the volume will increase, and when the melody notes fall in pitch, the volume will decrease. In general, the left hand of most songs will be the spot where the beat of the song manifests most strongly. In general, the first notes of each, uh, in general, the first note in the left hand of most so songs will be the spot where the beat of the song manifests most strongly. In general, the first note of each bar of music in the left hand is slightly emphasized to give a good strong beat and the lower notes are emphasized slightly. Now, this causes the playing of the piece of music to have greater depth and contrast. At the conclusion of the piece will be a slight retardando, or a slight slowing down of the tempo, so that the listener can hear that the song is about to end. And this is the melody of Isle A. Kai in Bayon Town. Uh, illustrating the beginning, the ending, the climax point, and also the De Capo El Fine and the true ending of the piece of the music. Excellent. And here is the easy version of Isle I Kai in Bayon Town. Mm -hmm. 
version of Isle Ai Kai in Bai Yon Town, more notes have been added to the left hand to give a fuller sound to the piece of music. And at the conclusion of the piece will be a slight retardando or a slight slowing down of the tempo so that the listener can hear that the song is about to end. And this is the advanced version of Isle Ai Kai in Bai Yon Town. Thank you. A solo performance version of Alai Ai Kai in Bai Yon Town, starting first with the easy harp arrangement, immediately followed by the advanced harp arrangement. <laughs> videos now on many different topics and so I've decided to make several different video playlists so that it's easier to find the videos of greatest interest. So please check out my playlist page. Well that's it for now. To stay up to date with my latest videos make sure to subscribe to this free YouTube channel by clicking the red subscribe button right below this video. Take care.